Welcome back. You're watching Quest for Quiz, the qualifying round for TVJ's Junior Schools Challenge Quiz. We made an adjustment to the scores and Little Bay is on six and Highgate Primary is now on four. It's now time for the Junior Challenge Face-Off, which covers math, science, English language and social studies. The teams have already made their selections for each face-off. So let's begin with the math face-off between Casia Thompson from Little Bay and Shajanik Latibodere, the captain of Highgate Primary. Casia, a boy lost a quarter of his $256 allowance. How much money did he lose? Would you like to try, Shajanik? No, thank you. $64. Casia, what is the sum of 33.5 and 3.9? Thirty-seven point four. Correct. What is ten meters converted to centimeters? Two centimeter. Repeat. Two centimeter. Incorrect. Would you like to try, Shashanik? No, thank you. One thousand centimeters. Casia, what is twelve minutes as a fraction? of one hour in its lowest term. Would you like to try, Shajanik? No, thank you. One over five. And case here, your final question. question. Find the area of a triangle if its height is 14 centimeters and base is eight centimeters. One point one, one hundred and twelve centimeter. Incorrect. Would you like to try, Shajanik? No, thank you. Fifty-six centimeters squared. Your questions now, Shajanik. A girl gave away one fifth of her two hundred and twenty-five dollar an hour allowance. How much money is she left with? Do you like to try KCO? No, thank you. $180. Shajanik, what is the sum of 36.9 and 4.5? Would you like to try KCO? Yes, thank you. 41.4. That is correct. Back to you, Shajanik. What is 4,000 millimeters? converted to centimeters. Would you like to try KCO? No, thank you. 400 centimeters. Shajanik, what is 45 seconds as a fraction of one minute in its lowest term? Kesia, would you like to try? No, thank you. It's three and a quarter. And the final question for Shajanik, find the area of a triangle if its height is 16 centimeters and base is six centimeters. Would you like to try, Kesia? No, thank you. The answer is 48 centimeters squared. That's the end of the math face-off. We move on to science between Acacia Gale from Little Bay and Chrissy Lee Grant from Highgate. Acacia, what is the SI unit used for the measurement of time? O'clock. 
Incorrect. Would you like to try, Chris Lee? No, thank you. It's seconds. Acacia, what is the name for a transparent tank of water used to keep fish and other things that live in water? Aquarium. Correct. What word, starting with F, describes soil which has many nutrients? Would you like to try, Chris Lee? No, thank you. It's fertile. Acacia, a loud explosion can cause damage to which specific part of the air? The air canal? Judges? She said air canal. Would you like to try, Chris Lee? No, thank you. It's the air drum, cochlea, or inner air. Speak up for me, Acacia. Your final question, which household pest spreads dengue fever? Mosquito. That's correct. Chrissy Lee, what is the SI unit used for the measurement of temperature? A thermometer. Incorrect. Thermo Would you like to try, KCO? Yes, thank you. Degrees. Incorrect. It's Kelvin. Chrissy Lee, back to you. How many arms does an octopus have? Eight. Correct. What word, starting with C, is the name given to decayed plant material used as fertilizers? Would you like to try, Casio? No, thank you. Compost is the answer. Chrissy Lee, what is the collective name for the three tiny bones in the human's middle ear? Casio, question passes to you. No, thank you. Ossicles is the answer. And the final question for Chrissy Lee, which animal spreads leptospirosis? Rats. That is correct. We move on now to English language, and this is Kendra Cornwall from Little Bay up against Deja Lee Fong Chung from Highgate. Kendra, by adding a prefix, give the opposite of rational. Unrational. Incorrect. Would you like to try Deja Lee? Yes, thank you. Irrational. That is correct. Kendra, spell container. C-O-N-T-A-I-N-E-R. Correct. Identify the possessive noun in the sentence. We stayed at our uncle's house for the holidays. Stayed. Incorrect. Would you like to try Deja Lee? Yes, thank you, uncle. That's correct. Back to you, Kendra. Form an adjective from the word caution. Cautionable. Incorrect. Would you like to try Deja Lee? No, thank you. Cautious. Kendra, identify the words in the sentence that must be in capital letters. The school bus arrived late on Monday. School and Monday. Incorrect. Would you like to try Deja Lee? Yes, thank you. Monday. Incorrect. It's the and Monday. Your questions now, Deja Lee, by changing the prefix, give the opposite of inferior. Would you like to try, Kendra? No, thank you. It's superior. Deja Lee, spell damage. D-A-M-A-G-E. Correct. Identify the possessive pronoun in this sentence. This blue book is mine. Question passes to you, Kendra. Would you like to try? Yes, please. Mine. That is correct. Deja Lee, form an adjective from the word health. Healthy. Correct. Identify the words in the sentence that must be in capital letters. On the first day of May, we went to the beach. Beach on and the beach and on and beach. Incorrect. Would you like to try, Kendra? Yes, please. On and me. That is correct. That's the end of the English language face-off. The final face-off in social studies is between Captain Kenny K. Bryan from Little, B Little Bay up against Kwesian Dover from Highgate. Kenny K. Paul Bogle, one of Jamaica's national heroes, was a deacon in which church? Would you like to try Kwesi Ann? No, thank you. Baptist Church. Kenny K, complete this statement correctly. 
The national dish of Barbados is flying fish and... Coco. Say that again. Coco. Judges? Correct. Kenny K, which planet is known for its red spot? Jupiter. Correct. By what process are rocks broken down into small pieces without changing its location? Would you like to try, Kwesian? No, thank you. Weathering. And final question for you, Kenny K. What is the name given to the blocks of hard rocks that make up the continents? Limestone. Incorrect. Would you like to try, Kwesian? No, thank you. It's plates. Your question is now, Kwesian. What was the name of the uprising which took place in St. Thomas, Jamaica in 1865? Would you like to try, Kenny K? Yes, thank you. Marat Berbellion? That is correct. Kwesian, complete this statement correctly. The national dish of St. Vincent and the Grenadines is roasted breadfruit and... Would you like to try, Kenny K? No, thank you. And jackfish. Kwesian, which planet has a moon called Triton? Would you like to try, Kenny K? Yes, thank you. Uranus? Incorrect. It's Neptune. Kwesian, what is formed when rocks are broken down into small pieces and mixed with air, water, dead plants, and animals? Would you like to try, Kenny K? No, thank you. It's soil. And final question for you, Kwesian. When plates under the earth collide, the rocks break or crack. Which term is used to describe a crack or break in the rocks? Kenny K, would you like to try? Yes, thank you. Earthquake? Incorrect. It's a fault. And that brings us to the end of section two with Little Bay on 13 and Highgate on nine. Stay tuned, more quest for quiz when we return from this break.